we got here. And welcome to another episode of Fishing Southern Maryland. And welcome to another episode of Fishing Southern Maryland. I'm All right, everyone, it's a Saturday evening, five o'clock. I'm back at St. Mary's Lake. I got about a two hour window to fish. I'm gonna see how many species I can get. Come along for the ride. All right, there's one. Oh my, looks like it's a nice large mouth. I want a little panfish magnet. There we go. Come on over here, buddy. Yeah. Right there in the corner of his mouth. There we go. That took long enough. Nice large mouth. Fish number two. Looks like a nice size bluegill. Caught right over by that little set of trees or sticks. Yeah, nice hand sized bluegill. That's tube species. Is there another panfish hanging out over here somewhere? Another bluegill, nice size one. Caught right on this point. Oh, there's a shiner. Little golden shiner. That's three species. Four. Holy moly. That's a huge shiner. Look at the size of that thing. I said fish number four, it's actually fish number five. They must be up there spawning. Yep, they must be up there spawning. There's something a little nicer, I think. Oh my, oh, okay. What have we got here? We got another largemouth. Uh, bigger than the last one. Yeah, bigger than the last one. That came out a lot easier. Good bud, thank you sir. Okay, what we got here? That feels like a bluegill. Maybe it's a red ear? No, it's a bluegill, okay. Another bluegill? Another bluegill. Bluegill number six. Okay, so I want to bring you up to speed with, with what I'm using today. Uh, about two weeks ago, my sister uh, sent me a text saying, hey, let's get together and have lunch. Um, and, and that way we can celebrate uh, Tim or Timmy's uh, birthday. Timmy's my nephew. He's in seventh grade. So what, he turned 12? I think he's 12, um, if I remember correctly. Um, he and his mom get to go out and go fishing every once in a while, and so I put together a little box for him. One of the things I picked up for him is what I'm using today, too. A uh, panfish magnet kit, uh, made by the same people as a trout magnet, as you can see. Um, and they've been working. Comes with a little uh, 160, or comes with four or five, maybe, maybe half a dozen, you know, 164th ounce jigs with multiple, or as they call it, assorted colors of little baits, little split tail type of baits. Um, and it's been working today. I mean, the first few fish I caught, you know, tore this one up enough that I had to put a different one on there, different one on there. So, will I swear by it? No. Am I getting paid for this? No. Are they working? 
Yes, they are. Check them out. You only got to... Oh, it popped off. Oh, I can't believe that. So here before Easter break, I said right at the very beginning of the video, I always turn left when I come out of the launch. I always turn left. Next time I come, I should turn right. I turned right this time. Great blue heron. You won't be able to see it. But I turned right this time to try a couple other things. Um, up on the on the northern side of the lake and now I've come back over to the south side because I probably have about another 20 minutes before I probably should get out of the park so I'm gonna give this area a try on the way back to the launch and see how I do Ow. species number four <laughs> a very very little yellow perch Almost didn't know he was on there. Right here at the launch. What have we got? Is it species number five? My goodness, what is he? It's species. Oh my goodness, look at the size of that one. That is species number five. A red ear. Nice size red ear, too. Let me see him. Good size red ear. Nine and a half inches. Yeah, buddy. Make sure that's in park. I don't I don't like to film and drive. I that's the epitome to me of distracted driving. Um, so anyway, two Two hours, 15 minutes on the water, five different species of fish, springtime. Fish are coming up to the bank, getting ready to spawn. It's a great time to be out there. Hopefully you're getting out there as well. Uh, I think I counted them up and I got 11 fish. So I had two largemouth, two of the shiners, that one red ear, one perch. Oh, wait a minute. That gives me an even dozen because I did catch six bluegill. But I had a great time. Hopefully you're getting out and fishing as well. Send me pictures. I'll put the link down in the description. I'll also put it right here so you can actually see or you can send me some pictures because I want to see what you're catching as well. I'll put them in as the fish of the day. We're going to end this one today. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. And until next time, tight lines.